everyone, I'm Laura Noel, and here on my channel, we are all about simple living and holistic living by combining simplicity, family, and hope. Today, I'm unboxing some super, super special boxes. I'm so excited. They are all the way from London, and they combine the elements of simple living and hope. If you've been following along on our journey, there is something that I have been loving lately, learning about, and that's growth mindset and being of a more holistic approach of this whole learning through play and positive parenting and all of these things. I've found some really awesome resources that are helping us to do that even better. These boxes here are called Kindness Elves, and I'm so excited. It is November when I'm opening them. I'm super excited to get them in time for Christmas. Most of us have heard of Elf on the Shelf and how just popular it is, but here's the problem with Elf on the Shelf. While many people have a lot of fun with it and their kids love it, I decided that was not something I wanted to do in our family. With Elf on the Shelf, there's a big emphasis on being good and versus being bad and Santa and all of those things. And that's not really something that we wanted to instill in our family. So I was really excited to find an alternative that is much more growth mindset and outward focused, um, more focused on helping people and the real meaning of Christmas than being judged on your behavior. Now, there's nothing wrong with Elf on the Shelf if you like to do it, totally fine. It's just not for our family and I found this was a fantastic positive alternative. So, let's open the box. I was able to grab a sale and a coupon on these. They do come from London, so there is that over the seas shipping, but they were a great deal and I got the Camp Kindness Bundle. So it came with these three boxes and then also a Camp Kindness PDF, uh, which is packed with all kinds of awesome activities and um, stuff that I can't wait to do with my daughter when she's a little bit older. This box is the elves themselves. I, oh my gosh, so freaking cute. Oh, look at this. I mean, how much cuter is this than up on the shelf? You can choose your colors. They have multiple color choices. There's two little elves in there and they have a little house. So, so cute. Oh my goodness. All right, let's see here. It's got a magnetic door. Sprinkle kindness wherever you go. Magic mail. Oh, that is so cute. Okay, super, super adorable. There's the inside of the house. How a cute. They are so adorable. Look at these little things. They're handmade. They were an Etsy shop and now they have a website. Oh my goodness, they're just these little wooden dolls. <laughs> I love them. Oh my gosh. So, so cute. And there's the other part of her house. So adorable. I love it. I just love that the focus isn't about like a child being good or bad, but it's about, it's not even about them at all. It's about spreading kindness and love and generosity to the people around us. This is actually a mailbox, guys. Look at that. It's got a mail slot and then a little thing in here. Then with the Camp Kindness Bundle, they have a whole bunch of different bundles. You can get just the elves, or you can also get, this is the accessories pack. So let's look in here. Oh, so cute. I just love that sprinkle kindness wherever you go. Like how, how awesome. Okay, up on top, the little book of big kindnesses. Oh, how cute. A collection of some of the little acts of kindnesses. So we've got Mail. I'm gonna have to figure all this out. Um, magic mail, lovely letters, miracle post, elf delivery. Okay, so this looks like, oh, I get it. It's a place to put the cards. Okay, hold on. We're gonna get to the cards. So you can keep track of the ones you do, and then there's kindness doodles. They can doodle and draw. Very cool. So it's just kind of a record. All right, so then we've got all these boxes here. Let's see. 
Um, these are stickers. Okay. So I imagine there are ways to use those. Okay. These are the cards here. Magic hearts. Some of them have um, words written on them and then like a blank side. Some of them are blank on both sides, but there's just little ideas of, hello, let's make some fudge or other sweets and give it to this crossing patrol or the school bus driver. Sort through your outgrown clothes and donate them to a younger child who may love them. Just all kinds of look, look out for the lonely child on the playground and invite them into your game. Super cute ideas and then some that you can add on your own as well. That's so awesome. So there's a whole stack of those. And these last two little ones, you've got magic postcards. Oh my gosh, they're so tiny. It just has like a picture and then it's actually like a little tiny postcard. Oh my goodness. There's several designs of them. Oh my too cute too cute too cute all right and the last one it is magic sprinkles it's like stardust little glitter magic sprinkles <laughs> so you've got 50 postcards from the elves to the children 50 kindness act suggestion hearts for the kids to do for others and then magic dust to bring the elves to life and stickers to sprinkle kindness. This, I love it. It's just, it's thought out so well. And then they can put their magic postcards into the book and oh my goodness, space for them to write notes about their adventures. Okay, last one. This is the story of the kindness elves. Just like the elf, elf on the shelf has a story so do the kind of selves. But again, I just like this one better. <laughs> so it's a beautiful picture book. Gorgeous, gorgeous. And it's just gorgeously illustrated. So, so fun about how they're helping others and how they're helping families help others. I love it. The story of the kind of selves introduces children to the joy that showing daily acts of kindness can bring in whimsical and magical ways. Oh my goodness. That's what I'm all about. <laughs> this is what it's all about. Creativity, love, generosity. I just love it. So there you have it. That is the Kindness Elves unboxing. I cannot wait to do this with my daughter. She, They are recommended for ages three and up just because the dolls are handmade and uh, young children tend to be a little bit rough. They do need to be kept out of the child's reach. Um, so just something to keep in mind with little kids. If you're interested in checking out their website or getting your own set, there is a link below to check that out. And if you want to keep following along with our Simple Living Growth Mindset journey, please click subscribe. Let me know in the comments below what you think of these really cute kindness elves. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time.